Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Seamount for Life here with another PGA Tour 2K23 video. Again, shout out to 2K and HB for giving me access to the early preview version of PGA Tour 2K23 that comes out October 14th. In today's video, we're going to take our first look at the My Career mode. We're going to go through some of the menu items there in the hub of My Career, and then we're going to jump in and play the first round of the first event. Let's go take a look. All right, here we go. Let's dive on into the My Career mode here in PGA Tour 2K23. So a lot like 2K21, you're able to select where you want to start your career. We're going to go ahead and just jump straight to PGA Tour. Now on here, you can then select the difficulty of the AI scoring and the course conditions. I like that they're separate. It gives a lot of flexibility there. And then, of course, you can also change the number of rounds per event. And these items can be altered a little bit later as well within the hub. All right, here's the hub. So from here, you got the uh, week event standings, your sponsors, and of course, your rivals. Let's tab on over to the schedule page. So from here, you can go ahead and look through all of the My Career schedule. One nice little addition here is the ability to swap out any of the non-licensed courses. However, what we've learned is the courses available as replacements have to come from the 2K approved list of courses. And my hope here is that they will continuously refresh this list as uh, the life cycle of the game you know, matures. And the nice part here is it's actually pretty simple to do so, and I'll actually walk you through that here in just a minute. So from right here, we can go ahead and choose this week one event, and you can just go ahead and go down to swap course, and then that would take you over to the 2K approved courses to swap out. So remember, you can only swap the filler courses. You cannot swap the licensed events. Next, we'll swap over to records. We've got player records, season stats, and of course your trophy room. And then finally, settings. You can change these at any time. You got opponent difficulty, you've got your conditions, you've got um, the AI scoring, all of that stuff. Go ahead and swap whenever you would like. Any of the swing difficulty items, you can go ahead and do that through the main menu. And you can actually separate the different round counts, which I think is pretty cool too. So back to the hub. Now we're actually going to take a look at the sponsors area. So this is actually much more streamlined in PGA 2K23, although it is pretty similar to 2K21. You can now have, have up to three sponsors activated at one time, which is fantastic. Essentially, you can get apparel, clubs, balls, any sort of rewards, depending on the different brands and their availability of those rewards. You can gain reputation by simply just selecting the brand, selecting what you're going to be playing for. And then as your reputation grows with that brand, you'll essentially level up your reputation, which will then not only unlock items for that brand, but will unlock additional brands that you can then sign sponsorships for, and then just rinse and repeat that throughout the career mode to unlock all kinds of different items. Again, apparel, clubs, as well as balls. And here's just some of the different brands they have in the game. All right, back to the hub. Let's go and dive into the first event. This is the Bluff Championship at Craigie Heights. This is actually an Arctic Fury course, so we're gonna be in for a visual treat here. Just as a heads up, as we load into this, I am gonna be playing on the default master difficulty setting, but I have turned off the distance control meter. I didn't wanna play with the uh, power meter on, but everything else is again, default master settings. Sports and the PGA Tour are delighted to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Bluff Championship is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this first round action. I'm Luke Elvey, alongside Rich Beam in the booth. That's such a good and shot right there. Kenny Koyak down on the course, following our featured group. Hi Luke, great to be with you guys. Now this group will be one to watch today. Lots of chatter on social media leading up to this pairing. We have a rookie on tour who is set. There's my rival there, Ricky Fowler. We got Panda on the bag there. First shot of the caddy. 
Love it, Henny. This will make for an extra layer of excitement. It always adds a bit more drama to an event when we can follow a competition within a competition. Right, here we go. Can't wait to really stiff left to right wins, so let's see if we can get it on. Uh, and let's see what he can do here. Got a great fast. I don't think it's going to make it back. That's all right. That's not what they hope It's a par for. five, so we're probably not going to be able to get on in two, but Penny, how's that ball lying? let's try to get Looks it up like here in the fairway. Here in the sand. Oh. oh. Well, that didn't work out, did it? So one thing I've noticed in this year's game what is the ball flight, here? especially on your longer I clubs, is a lot lower, and I actually really here. love this the ball flight in this uphill. game. I think it's much more realistic. Going with the five wood. See if we can get the five wood up there. Uh, all right. So this also brings up here as Panda and I come walking down the fairway here. This kind of brings in the new chipping. So the chipping is a lot tougher. The chipping uh, actually goes 25 yards. So you have to partial everything. It's really sensitive and it's something that um, it's taken me a while to kind of get used to. I think most will, but it's definitely a change, and I think it's a change for the better. All right, first putt here. A little par action. Feels like out here. Oh, be the speed. Nice. We drain it. Look at that tiger fist bump on the par. Amazing. Getting that one, that is That's a another really, bonus. really pretty shot there. Let's see what happens here All right. on the second hole. Par four into the wind. I'll put a little bit of fade on this. Ah. Very slow again. One thing you'll notice here, again, at least in the early preview version that we're playing, is the gray zones are a lot larger. But it kind of feels like the white well, perfect zones sure are smaller, and I absolutely mind. love the change. And he's down there, setting up here from I think it'll make Master and even Legend yards. a lot more playable. Right, let's try to draw it or uh, fade it around the tree. Ah, we didn't get it. Well, that's not ideal. The good swing, but clip the tree. Henny, how's that ball lying? It's tough to see from here. Well, it's a little deeper into the rough, but it's sitting Actually, nicely. Actually, have a pretty good lie in this rough here. See if we can get it up. And eh, not too bad. I think we're playing. I think these are firm greens. Firm greens, firm fairways, fast greens is what we're looking at in terms of settings. Let's see if we can drain another par here. Get in. Oh. Just off the edge. This next part is for bogey. Right over the spot they were there looking we at. Yep. Oh. Well, hold for bogey. Looks like we're this was jumping back shot. here. I'm guessing. Yeah, Ricky Fowler here, my rival. Looks like he's gonna knock that close. <laughs> I guess he's pretty pumped about and knocking that up for a tap in par. So the leaderboards, from what I can tell, have been fixed. So I think that's a big positive there. And after a bogey at the last, they're looking for a big drive on this hole. Huh, that's interesting. A big drive on a par three? That's probably a bug. All right, here we go. Into the wind, very stiff, 13 miles an hour. Let's put a little up, up loft on this. Going with the five Good swing here. Now. Perfect and tempo, a little bit up. of a right push. It's like the distance is just about perfect. Pretty happy with that. All right, That's first birdie opportunity here. Let's drain it. This putt is about 15 feet to the hole. So I really love. This is what they have left for birdie, Really love yeah. how the greens roll in this game. Reminds me a lot more of like 2K night, uh, or I mean uh, PG, uh, TGC Tours 2019 roll, as oh, opposed to line was looking good, wasn't it? the PGA 2K21 the roll, which I awaits. thought was a little frictiony. So. But, of course, we miss it while I'm talking, and then we tap in from far. Alright, fourth hole here. A little right to left. This is interesting. 
Ooh, we probably should have put some fade on that, but we get away with it. Got a gray fast. Perfect position. But Henny, what are you seeing down there? Sitting up here. 158, we're down nine, so it's playing 155. The wind's going to give us a little help. I actually like the club here. Came with the mm. nine iron, I think. Not a bad swing. We pushed it, no, but the fast sure should probably offset that a little bit. That's further right than they wanted. Uh, come on, slow down. Eh, not shot. ideal, but could Slim have been a lot worse. Birdie, but in all reality, Ooh, two got a, sh a shot putt here. Let's see if we can get it in here for Bird. It's tracking. Ah. Oh. Just missed. Ooh, slow down. See, this is what I'm talking about with, with the greens. You really have to be careful with downhill in this game. It's actually pretty what rad. Looking at for this putt, Henny? Really have to Set be careful. This putt, 18 feet from the cup. Yeah, pull right to left here. This I don't think I hit it. Yeah. Shot. Dang it. You always like that on long putts. Three putt you bogey. Go ahead and tap it in stress free. Looks like another this was his second. Cutback highlight here, Ricky Fowler. What do you got for me? They say it's his second shot here. I'm guessing this is his approach. Probably sink that right there for well, Birdie is my guess. On the Let's take a look. Yeah, it looks like we're both plus two there. It's time to step onto the tee here at the fifth. All right, par five. Let's let's get a good drive and get on for eagle, huh? Ooh, I like this. Get over the bunker. Well, I like the look of the line here. There we go. The yeah, that that new fly cam, that new follow cam, uh, threw me off a bit. I'm I started to get used to it, but for this one, guys. it did throw me off. I like it though. I like this steeper angle. This is uphill. Probably playing about 250, 255. <sighs> yeah. The slow and the 95%, that doesn't work out well. And here we are with the third shot. All right, this actually is a good distance for the chip. Won't even have to partial it. Ah, uh, but we slowed it. Damn, slow end push, but distance was perfect. And just about eight feet left to the there hole. Here we go. Birdie if time should just be right, this, just off the right edge. Ahead of Fowler. This could get interesting. There we go. And that's a great Birdie time. That Cheers. Wow, a lot of flashbacks here. This is his third. More Fowler. Oh, I thought he was going to jar that. <laughs> Celebrations. And how did that great shot impact the score? Let's have a look at the leaderboard. So we both birdied there. Oh, he must have parred that. That must have been for a chip in for par. It must have been on a par four because he said that was his third shot. So I birdied Let's par for Fowler. We're one up six. on Fowler. Downhill with the wind. Not a great swing, but we're going to get away with it. I keep having this like 6.30 to 12.30 swing lane, uh, swing plane, so we need to fix that. Sitting at one over. Perfect angle here. Put a little bit of loft on this one. Or a little bit of a swing angle. Get some spin on it. That's ah. right, a little jerky from where I'm sitting. Oh, that was awful. Not sure if that's how they drew it up. Missing it short there, they will definitely be upset. So again, the partial chip here is just it's just an interesting change. I think we'll all get used to it, but it, it's it's what definitely are we different. At for this part, Henny. Just gotta trickle this one in the front door. It's downhill. It's tracking. There we go. Oh, wonderful effort. Confused. Just off right edge. A little parski. Wow, a lot. Lining up for his second. 
kicking over. Oh, we got John Rahm here. All right. I can dig it. Second shot. I'm guessing on a par, par four there. He's probably going to tap that in for lead. Bird. Now, Carrot Leader is enjoying a one shot lead. We're all chasing Tiger. Look at that. Top of the leaderboard. 400 through six. That's boy, Tiger. And after that par, they're looking for something good here. And we'll just hit three wood here. Oh, thankfully we snuck on. I'd have hated myself. We didn't. Yeah, that one will play. We clubbed down to three wood and then we didn't hit it Henny? in the they're fairway. Out this next shot into quite an elevated green, Luke. Yeah, this is playing 117. Let's uh let's actually club up and just let's do full loft. Let's let's see how this reacts. It's a slow but not a bad swing. Okay, get down. Ah. Not a ton of spin there. Remember, though, I am basically using a very low-end character, range. both There's in skills way, and in what, uh, clubs. So, before, so and look at chance. that downhill, too. All right, shot putt. Uh, get up the hill. Oh, are we going to have enough speed? Get there. Yes. Shot glasses out, baby. Love it. Well, that's worth a replay. Let's take another look. What All right, let's see how the replay looks. Way out. Not too bad of a replay angle here. Look at the speed of this thing. Oh, that's so good. All right, there we go. Trailing by five shots after that hole. Down five, but we fought our way back to even. That's such a pretty shot of that bridge. This course looks amazing. It's downhill. I'm going to take a little bit off of this. Ooh, we got a perfect. Yeah. I didn't think the wind would move it that much. 13 miles an hour. I probably should have moved it over a little bit more. It does kind of feel like the wind doesn't do quite as much movement, which I love, but I honestly didn't pay that much attention, so we'll have to test more out when I get my hands on it again. Ooh, right by the hole. This putt just five feet away from the hole. Man, I missed a lot of putts off the edge. So no movement there. The player remains at even. All right, we're still at even. Three ahead of Fowler. Looks like John Rahm took the lead. Here we are at the final hole on the front nine. Tiger must have bogeyed there. Yeah, great rhythm on that swing. Really good drive here. Come on, kick left. Stay left. Stay left. Ugh. Man, I hate that. Our wind's just going to knock the ball down. It's straight at the back. And hopefully this is enough club here. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. Uh, get up. I think we wow, got there. did this come out beautifully. Awesome. Oh, what a lovely shot. He'll be delighted to be inside the range there. Already had a few birdies All right, today. Another birdie putt another here. Opportunity for another one. Let's take Slippery a look. downhill, right to left. We just got to get it started. Oh, no. Okay, steady Oof. now. Hold on. I'm telling you right now, downhill putts in this game are An scary. To make a par here. That, that's a green, that's a yellow to a green slope, you guys. Nice little putt to hold that one. You're really going to want to have uphill putts. Let's recap his fourth shot. Where are we going now? Back to Fowler here. For birdie. Oh, he got it. Let's take a look at the leaderboard. I think it just flashed plus three. He shot it. So well, I'm Rich, wondering if he's going to be plus three or now he's plus two. Plus so two. Far? Okay, so that well, worked out there. 
fun watching this player awesome. duke it out with their rival, that's for sure. They're winning the rivalry thus far. Should be fun to see where these two end up at the end of the event. A little bit of shape on this. Ah, but then we hit the slow. We're going to go right in this bunker. Ah, dang it. Oof, not a good spot. Yeah, Uphill bunker. Penny, oh, this lip. This lie? The perfect lie in the sand doesn't exist. <laughs> oh, yes, it does. It's sitting good. Actually, we have another good lie. Yeah, she's right. I hit a five iron over here. Oh, we clipped it again. I'm telling you right now, it's going to be a bit of an adjustment. I like what the change, it but it's here, it's a lot now different in 2K21 in terms of here. the lower ball flights. Opting for the five iron. Oh, what a shot this is. Right by the stick. That one seemed to get away from them, Rich. All right, again, no way I'm chipping this. this. This is a, a completely different thing on this game, so we're going to go ahead and putt this. Yeah, see ya. Look at this thing roll. I love that this is probably the better play nowadays. Um, instead of chipping it. It might be borderline chip, but... The putt is the safer play oh, here, so and we miss both of them. Uh, dear, this next putt now. Uh, yeah, well hold. Really Let's good holes back to back there. We were two under through the last John five holes, and then we so throw a double bogey up and completely wipe that out. I love how they kind of do these points of interest on these uh, courses. Off here at the Looks 11. good. Arctic rushed it. Okay. Part three, into the wind, a little bit of up loft. Couple of birdies, Don't mind the swing. Ah, it's actually today. It's going a little bit farther right than I thought. I guess I did push it in a little bit of a slow there. All right. Not a bad approach. Birdie the putt. From the caddy. You're dancing. Slim chance here for birdie, right. but you never know. Oh, Justin now. Thomas. PGA 2K21 cover athlete. Drains it. Now. I think he said he was plus two, so he might be right around where I'm at. And he's down there. You got a read? Setting up this part 30 right, feet. Here we go. The Their short game today is very Again, delicate downhill. You have to be so careful with these. I'm gonna aim this way and let's just see what happens. Come on. Yeah, not not even a chance. That might be off the green. Oh man. Twelve feet to the cup coming up. Looking really good. There we go. Whew. Well, that's a momentum. Right in the center. Well done. John Rahm, your leader, as we head to the next hole. Yeah, Tiger must have bogeyed there. He's at four under. Welcome to the tee at this par five hole. Go get after it. Yeah, I don't think that's too much of a risk. Let's just go here. Uh, yeah, okay, this will work. This one's looking good off the tee. That should find the short stuff. That's perfect. Maybe we can get on here. Should have a shot at this in two. The great Severano Ballesteros inspired an entire generation of European golfers, particularly his three wood Spanish driver. Golfers, and I feel that we might even have the best Spanish yeah, let's go three wood. time in John Ramridge. I absolutely agree. Oh, with that. that's smoked. I, I believe in the game right now, Luke. That get up. If there's one player that all others are fearful on. of when they get on Roll. top of the leaderboard, uh, I think John Rahm's name would be. Oh, we're kind of in no man's land here. Ha <laughs> ha. Has zero weakness. Liam Panda coming up the fairway. One. I look at his game, and it is so complete. Okay, let's see if we can partial this. Envious of it, don't you? Because it is so good everywhere. Yeah, not too bad. Iron play, the short Roll up. The the nice. The imagination. He's what is Rich Beam going on about? It's a tap in birdie. We'll he take it. By far, I believe the most complete player in our game today. Yeah, it certainly feels like we're in the John Rahm era right now. Fowler. Interesting angle. Apparently he made that. 
Wow, he matched me. I think we're both plus one now, right? Oh, he's plus two and I'm plus one, okay. John Rahm still in the lead. Gary Woodland in second. We've arrived at a par four hole. Projected cut plus two. Great swing here. Good shot there. Really, really love the club impact sure. noises. They are so good. And what's in front of them there, Henny? This is looking around 115 yards out. Ooh, 116. Wind at my back. Let's throw some loft on this. Try to. Ooh, good swing. I like this a lot. Oh, it's got to get up. Hmm. I thought the wind was going to do a lot more to that. Oh, uh, now we're chipping. Yeah, let's uh, let's putt this. Here we go. Curl. Ouch, that hurts. Yeah, that was a bad, bad putt there. Putting for a par here. Oh, what a stroke. There we go. Yeah, nice to make a mid-range par putt. Not too bad there. Really wish uh, we'd got on in regulation. Trailing by six shots after that hole. I love this shot here. Look how pretty that is. You've arrived at a par four. All right. Step up to the End of the line. wind. This is probably going to play really long. And going, Look at that swing. That sizzle you hear when you hit perfect driver is just so good. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? Yeah, this is straight back into the breeze. Going to be a tough one. Yeah, we're going to go five wood here into the wind. Uh, the slow and a push. We're going to miss this right. It does feel like the swing plane plays a lot more in to the swing result, which I actually like that as well. But like in 2K21, it was like the swing plane didn't do as much as it should have, and then it was pretty much down to your tempo. So I do like that it feels like it's a bit more impacted by the swing plane. And here again, here's this, this partial chip, right? You partially, but you hit it fast, and it goes way long. Can't be too aggressive here. Take your medicine and move on. This is down the hill. Come on. Oh. Curl. Yeah. Slow down. God, I can't believe how much these things roll. It's going to take a bit to adjust to it. It's looking solid. Love how they roll, though. Again, I can't say that enough. Like, how they roll... Really love it. Just a matter of adjusting. And take a look at his fourth now. Fowler for par. Oh, he missed it. Yeah, that mighty shot. There we go. Worth a move up the leaderboard. Let's see what it's done. The leader now has a one-stroke advantage. And he's plus three now. So all that matches up. That's good. We have a par three on this one. All right, 187, we're down four, 183. Now let's hit this. Going with the seven. Oh, this could be pretty. Going for less club here. Come on, bounce up there. Oh, a kick left. I thought we were gonna get a little hole in one possibility there. Still a good shot. Nicely done. Buddy right. for birdie. A little bit left to right. Let's go a cup left. Uphill too. Oh, I like this. Yes, curls it in. Hell yeah. Four birdies on the card. Well, good move there. Anything north on the leader. Alright, now we have we're two up on Fowler. Still trailing Rom. Rom, Woodland, and Woods have been pretty static there. One, two, three. Downhill par five. 101 slow here. Little baby fade. Be 20. 
Remember, I just have the basic clubs and basic build right now. And not have a ton of time to play and kind of grind and build up my character. So you'll be hitting balls a lot farther in this than what you're watching on this. This is just an early preview. Going with a three wood here. Love this. Look at the draw. Oh, yeah. Curl around. Get the duct tape out, baby. Well, this person displays the power game in pure fashion. Oh, Ricky's playing Always with me. Always like the okay. aggressive play, going for it in two and getting rewarded for it. All right, guys. The leaders here Eagle putt. So can make this. Looks like it breaks at my feet the and then 20. a little bit right to left. Uh, let's just go outside edge. It's downhill. Come on. Get in. Yes. Shot glass is out. Zippers exploding across YouTube. Gotta love it. He has an eagle putt as well. He missed it. Nice. We got another stroke up on Let's Fowler. That's weird. Then misses it, and then he celebrates. <laughs> Plus four. And now Did it, was that for par that he missed? I guess I didn't catch. I, th I thought he was putting for eagle, but maybe it wasn't eagle. Oh, let's let's try to get there. I, I, driver's too much. Let's hit three wood. We got the wind. Oh boy. A little butt pucker time here. Okay, we're good. We cleared it. Oh, I was really hoping for a right bounce there. That's all right. We're pin high here. And again, this used to be the old splash range, right? No longer. You can only splash in bunkers. You have to heavily rely on, on your chipping, which I think is great. Let's see how this rolls. Oh. Ooh, that almost went down. And this putt right. to move into Birdie the putt. top 10. Oh, look, yeah, just outside right edge here. Surely it's Get in. Yes. Wow. We got a nice run going here. Into the top 10. We're two under. What a turnaround here. And Tiger took the lead. Did you see that? All right, final hole here. Round one of career mode. Oh, God. Probably my worst swing of the day. That's heading into the rough, I think. Not even the wind can save us here. Sitting at two under. Currently right, tied for 10th place. Heavy rough. We're going to have to club up a few times. We got at least the wind at our back. I like how it kind of funnels into that back corner, though. If we can get some run on this, kind of land center but right to left angle, we might be able to get this back there to it. I like this right here. Five iron. Okay. We hit the fast as well. 102%. Get up there. Oh, keep running. Oh, my goodness. What a shot. But we're about maybe eight to ten yards short of where I would love to have been. But that's all right. We're on and we're putting. This putt is going to be He's found the brutal. surface. Good chance here. Outside chance here for the birdie. Oh my god! Yeah, uh, we're definitely aiming over this way. We just have to like make sure we hit the pace and maybe the right angle here. This is the old, the old mellow yellow putt, right? We're just gonna goal trickle this down the hill. Kind of like, I like right here. Let's do it. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah, yeah, Feed down. Oh, we're just a little bit off. Just two cups. Speed was great, though. I don't, I don't know how much closer What's you could possibly get it. This is a 12-footer here. This is what they have left for Oh, I pushed it. No. Four feet oh, to the cup. bummer. Ending it on a bogey. Signs off on today's round. Bummer. 
after a pretty decent opening round, Rich, this player still finds themselves... There we go. The there is the leaderboard here. Round, a decent round, but nothing spectacular, and that's why they're in the position that they're at. They just need to... Uh, they need to get out there and grind a little bit more. We didn't really see them out there giving it their full effort because they just got lazy. I mean, it's just an okay round of golf, and it shows. I'm just going to let them talk here. Tiger Woods in the lead. Rom in second. Woodland in third. We're in 18th. We're way ahead of Ricky Fowler, so that's good. There we go. That's the first round of the first event in the My Career mode. Here's a little shot at the progression. Just got up to level nine there. Let's take a look at the event stats, actually. I'm curious as to, like, how all this plays out. Looks like it's the same stats that we had in the previous games. 29 putts, terrible fairway and green regulation numbers there. Our proxy to the hole was not ideal. All right, let's go ahead and advance. There we go. We got a grip for our fitting hybrid grip. All right, there we go. That is our first look at the My Career Mode in PGA Tour 2K23. So what I want to do is just give some quick impressions and just some thoughts on this. Just for some additional context, I was able to play through the first five or six events of the career mode. So obviously didn't get to play through all of it, but a good, you know, 15 to 20% or so of what is in there. So I think the best way to approach the impressions conversation is probably a two-part answer and kind of want to compartmentalize those two takes. So the first take will be what we do have, and then the second take will be what we do not have. So let's start with the first one. What we do have is an improvement on the career mode from 2K21. The sponsors, the rivals system, all of that is much more streamlined. The leaderboards work, so that's a good positive there. Um, the new courses overall are absolutely fantastic. Not only the additional license courses were great, but uh, all of the additional filler courses were really, really well done. So shout out to the Next Maker course designers for crushing it there, and shout out to HB for giving them that opportunity to do so. The addition of the My Player skill points, club fittings, and overall just BC grind that this game has adds a lot of incentive to play this mode multiple times, and I do see myself doing so. And the most important part of all this is I had a great time just simply playing the game. I had a fun time. So getting into the career mode and playing through it with the additional improvements to the swing and more difficult short game, the variations with the My Player builds and archetypes and kind of experimenting there, it makes a lot of the moment to moment shot making better. And just the overall experience is a lot more enjoyable. Now on to the second take here, what we don't have. Being that it's only a slight improvement on what was already a pretty bare bones mode in 2K21, that to me is a disappointment. Um, with this being the first HB Studios golf game with a full development cycle on 2K's watch, I was really expecting there to be a big kind of expansion or beef up of the My Career mode, and we just didn't get it. I was really hoping they would add story mode elements like they have in the NBA 2K series. I was hoping with the additional playable pros that um, they would really integrate that into the career mode rivalry system. Maybe we would get some sort of head-to-head -head moments in tournaments or like a Mortal Kombat style, uh, like a match play tower that you'd be able to play through with Tiger Woods at the very top being like the final boss. Um, I mean, maybe even just random text messages throughout your career mode that you would get from pros to like challenge you. Maybe you get a text about challenging um, or getting a challenge from like Ricky Fowler at Top Golf or something like that. And you show up at Top Golf and you play against Ricky Fowler and it's like a best two out of three match to see who wins there. Um, there's just so much potential there and they already have put so much work into adding those pros, adding their swings, the attributes and all of that. And then of course, adding the Top Golf mode. It just in my brain makes so much sense to try to integrate as much of that as possible into the career mode and that just didn't happen. And then finally, the lack of anything centered around Tiger Woods I think was also a surprise for me. There's no Tiger moments. There's no way that you can play through career mode with Tiger. You can't play directly against him, at least not like in the fashion that I would like to see. 
I mean, yeah, you do see him on the leaderboard, and yeah, you do see him in highlights, and yes, he is a rival at the end of it, so like there will be some interactions there. There will be, I guess, more of Tiger than there was of JT, but not all that much more. Um, so I feel like he was severely underutilized in what I could see in the career mode side of what I had access to. So I'm really hoping that they take this mode and they run with it and they add all of these things that I'm talking about. And even more than that, I don't expect them to do it in this game. I don't think these are things they can patch in. I mean, we know there's more courses coming. We know there's more pros coming. We know there's more stuff coming and that's fantastic. And we'll be excited when that stuff shows up. But these sorts of additions, I feel like are going to need an entirely new dev cycle to get implemented. And I really, really hope they do because I feel like this mode has so much potential and they have the DNA to be able to do it. They even have stuff in the game that would add to this and make it so much better. So I really hope that that's a thing moving forward. So there we go. That is the first look at the My Career mode in PGA Tour 2K23. I just want to, again, thanks to 2K and HP for giving me the early access to the preview version of the game. Remember, the game is coming out October 14th on last gen, current gen, and on the PC. So for you guys, let me know what you think in the comments. I would love to hear your guys' thoughts. What are the additions to the career mode that you saw in this video that you're looking forward to? What are some of the things, you know, on top of what I've already said, or maybe you just want to agree with what I said, or any other additional ideas that you want to see added to the career mode in future iterations? As always, please like, comment, subscribe, as it really does help me here on the channel. And I do greatly appreciate all of the continued support that I've had both here on YouTube and also on my Twitch live streams. So thank you guys so much. That is all. Thank you for watching. And as always, cheers.